right here if you want to learn how I created this look and all of the products that I've used please keep on watching the first thing that I like to do is I like to always put my hair back I'm going to be starting with a primer I'm going to be using the liquid silk canvas from Tatcha and it is really good I just use like a pump and I will After the primer, I like to go ahead and apply my foundation. The one I'm using today is from NARS, and the color that I'm using is N6 Aruba, and this is a natural radiant. Maybe one pump to start with, and I put it on my beauty planner. You can put it on your face. I'm gonna do it on my face just so you guys can see. That's one, and then I like to do another one. That should be good. Just do two dots. Then I like to go ahead and grab my beauty blender and I kind of just dab it. You want to make sure that you blend in really well. After my foundation, I like to go ahead and apply my concealer. I'm going to be using the NARS, this is the mini one, and it's on medium to ginger. And I just like to do like... I don't like to use a lot. my setting powder this one that I'm using is the one from Laudermacher this is the one that I use most of the time they did came out with a new one and it's the honey setting powder and I really want to try it I personally don't like to use a lot of powder on my face especially now that we are you know transitioning to the colder weather I get my beauty blender and get some product and I will go ahead and put it on The only place that I do like to bake is part right here. I'm gonna go ahead and clean up my lip. I will be using this lip balm. And it's just something to moisturize my lips. While my lips are moisturizing and my face is baking, I like to go ahead and use my Contour Palette from Pat Bundy. The brush that I will be using is from Lancome number 25. I like to mix two shades on this palette. that I use for my face and I'm going to start contouring my nose. to be using shadow shadow play just to go all over my crease
Now for the eyes, I am going to be using my Anastasia palette. It does come with a little brush. I'm gonna start with this one. I like to put the product in, like so kind of tap it, like in a tapping motion, and then blend. After we had our base pretty much, what I did is that I applied it on my outer eyelid and on my crease. Then I like to go ahead and warm things up a little bit. So I want to use warm this color. I'm only just going to apply it on my outer eye. And I want to get just a little, like maybe one dab in the outer eyelid. And one more tab. I'll go ahead and use this palette again. And the brush that I am using is from BH Cosmetics number six. And I will be using the color Levitation. After I did my outer corner, I'm going to apply this color right here on my inner corners. Especially in the middle. I'm going to be using these two beautiful colors right here. I'm going to be mixing them. I have been using the same brush that came in the palette. How I like to clean up my eyebrows, I like to use something like this and I like to kind of dust all the product out. I like to use this for my eyebrows and it is a dip brow pomade and it is in the color Ash Brown. I like to use this angle brush from Sephora. my eyebrows are pretty much done already I will be having a video soon about my eyebrows I have a whole story about my eyebrows that you know I want to tell you guys about and I will be posting that video here hopefully soon but just stay tuned so you can learn more about my eyebrows Now something that I really do like to use on my eyebrow is the eyebrow gel just because I have a lot of hairs like that they will like fall if I don't keep them in place and I'm going to be using the Rare Beauty and this is from Selena Gomez. We are going to go ahead and do our eyeliner. I will be using the rare and this is also from Selena Gomez it's called very real I'm going to go ahead and do my under eye and I'm going to be using the BH Cosmetics number 12 
and I'm going to be using the same palette again. This color. Now I'm gonna go ahead and put um, false eyelashes. I am back and I put on my eyelashes. The ones that I use are from TJ Maxx and they are $5.99. This is a deal and I use the Kiss. Now I wanna go ahead and apply my blush. The blush that I'm going to use is Becca and it is the shade Flower child. I am using the fan brush. For the highlights, I am very excited. I will be using Becca as well in the color Champagne. to be using this precision you can even I love highlight I'm thinking since we're doing a fall look, we can also use it for Thanksgiving. I feel like Kylie Jenner has some really good lip kits. I don't normally wear them all the time just because they are really dry. I'm thinking about maybe using this one, but if you want something moisturizing and more soft, I would recommend you using the Rare Beauty. I will be using the lip kit from Kylie Jenner in the shade 20. This is the lip liner. I do like to go a little bit over my lips just to kind of make them look or appear a little bit bigger since these are my natural lips and you know I just like to have a little Now that I did my lips, I'm gonna go ahead and do a setting spray. The one I'm going to use is from All Nighter from Urban Decay. And this was just, it's a brand new one. There you go. This will just lock your makeup in place and just make it last longer. Please like and subscribe and thank you so much for watching. Bye!